Hey guys, I'm Coco. Welcome back to EO4. Let us continue with our conquest and colonization. Of course, we are playing as Coco Land, the mighty colonizing Western, well, not Western, High American Norse Aztecs. Indeed. We are important. We are very important. Right now, we are just killing some of our poor neighbors. Let's take that from them. Thank you, poor neighbors. Thank you. We are now mighty Coco Land. She got a fort up here, which is pretty cool. We can finally take this stack. So let's take it. It's going to be solid. We need to make a bunch of cores because for some reason they're expensive and now we'll not be able to get a new tech. And our dude died. Um, let's see if we can get a new guy from here. Master of Mint. Level 3. Let's do that. Uh, that would be you, right? Yes, indeed. Let's take you. And... Oh, right. We do have... Oh, I forgot. We do have economic ideas. So we do have that reduction. That's fine. Master of Mint is still gonna do good stuff for us. I trust. I trust. So yeah, basically next thing really is gonna most likely whenever they become a proper nation, which shall not happen that soon. Or maybe we'll actually be able to fight Hekawi. When this island is done, we'll go and colonize this most likely. Yeah, that's, that's the best place to be honest. I think we can actually uh, claim this by now, can't we? Yes, we can, just because of this province. This is actually Hutanami, the the birthplace. Oh, uh, I clicked on the wrong thing. It's the inland center of trade. That's what I meant. Uh, shall we get the military admin? Let's get it. Our agent wants instantly discovered, which is very unfortunate. What do we get next? More production efficiency. What about here? Trade range and trade efficiency in here. Artillery shock, artillery fire, combat with and new cannons. Pretty good. And training fields. Eraction in Republic. 3-4 uh, or 3-1. We are doing the military, so at least one point in there should be uh, required. So let's do that. Let's fabricate the claim on you, Utanani. And yeah, we're going with Freya. Continue to do so. Netherlands declared in three air. We have colonized up here. Pretty solid. 878. It's not too bad. Have a bunch of money. Oh, right. We have to have to improve, upgrade our ships, which is twelve hundred. Let's do so. It's gonna take a while, so let's do so. In ten months, this shall be a fearful navy, a navy to be feared, or something like that. Baron Heights. Well, it doesn't look too bad. People could live up here, especially in here, around here, there's a river, so I don't know why do you have to be wasteland, but you're a wasteland, so I respect that. That is your conscious decision, and I respect you for that, Baron Heights, it's, it's fine, it's all good, it's all good. Oh, we have separatists somewhere. Where would that be? Ready Jara and Ilmec. That's up here. Okay. You guys go here. You will have to fight them if they actually come knocking. Wow, three siege guy. Now that you're not war. Austria seed French lands to France. Pretty much. I'm not gonna try to pronounce them. 
But yeah, there you go. And the Netherlands are big, actually. They are strong. They do not have any exploration ideas. Which is a shame. But oh well. Seems to me like Breton banter is the last thing here. The first and the last. We gain the core. Uh, rebels are still present. They will happen. They will happen. We will kill them. That's fine. Hmm. I could upgrade these ships. I don't think uh, if I move them, it's gonna do much for us. If I just move them to a port right now. But I can upgrade you and I will upgrade you. No, doesn't doesn't do much for us. So I use them. I might actually just use them for war. Because there's no real need to protect the trade if there's no one else there. But this one province miner which shall die very soon. After this place is finished. 85 per year here. Why only 85? Didn't we say it should be 90? I guess you're getting 90. From tech, promised land, land of opportunity. And here? Uh, no adjacent controlled, really. Really, no adjacent controlled. Just because you're an island, you have to be a dick. Fine. If that's how you want to play it, we're going to play it like that. Need a bunch of cores. It's good. The ships are already done. Very solid. I like it. And I can smell the war already. I can smell it, boys and girls. It's gonna happen. <laughs> and it's gonna be beautiful. Indeed. So are you guys gonna revolt or what? We got a claim on Konami. The forts. Or we must always attack. I like siege ability. Siege ability is good. You're not gonna be that defensive. You usually are offensive. So there we go. And actually in some of these of our lands. I wonder. I very much doubt it. But if they do, they're welcome. They can come. We'll say hi. Hungary will see the Venezia is to enter visa to Siena. Damn Siena. I think you are going on the wrong side. How did you even get claims here. It's weird. Croatia only exists in Dalmatia. Transylvania actually ate some of Hungary. Interesting. Or did they pop out of Hungary? That's an option as well. Advisor died. Yay. The rebel uprising is not happening yet. Should soon. Castile, do you actually have exploration ideas and all that stuff? You do have exploration and expansion, yet I do not even see you down here. Maybe it's too far for you now, but you should be able to go up here at least. This must be in your range, I'm pretty sure it is. Maybe you just can't afford the money or something. Now oh, there we go. It's done, so let's go to Fa Facida. I can't, because this is not my core. God damn it! Let's go here then, or I could go here. Let's go to zone. I'll go to zone. That's fine. It's gonna take ages to arrive here, but yeah. oh well, right? Dude died. Let's get a new dude. Morale of armies. Sounds pretty solid to me. Continue on. Come on, you separatists. You know you can do it. Ah, you're done as well. Let's, let's have you protect. Actually, I wonder if I could send you as a pirate somewhere. 
if I could. I just, I wanted to click on pirate, but I didn't, or I did. I know, there's no one really, I could send you to Australia since it would seem we are, we, we are not holding that much power down there. Is Majo sending any of this? Is Majo even using? They're not even using their power here. I mean, I could, uh, I could get more power and then more money here, but why really? I don't really want to send those ships down there. For now, just stay here and protect the trade until we kill these guys, and then you'll just join the army fleet. And that's gonna be fine. Early frigates should be bigger now. Meh, not really, too small. That's fine. The question is how much people do you have? You need only 75 now because we are in Arctic. And no adjacent territory as well. Yes, minus 15 for that. Pretty beautiful. But still, it's gonna be it's gonna be 400 soon, and at 400 we get our bonus and we are happy. Yes, we are. How close are you guys? Oh, so close. 800. Just a bit more. There's gonna be a new nation. And we're gonna have fun with it. Right, right, boys and girls. We shall have fun with it. Hey Portuguese, I'm close to you. Do you want to be my ally? No. I'm close to you guys. You would actually be my ally. Even though it's not the same religious group. That is unfortunate. I don't really want you as an ally. Even though you are friends with France. But no. Thank you. We should go for sunset invasion with our Norse Aztecs. It would be beautiful. But now we are peaceful colonizers. Uh, no one knows that there were this island that we actually killed. There's only one left. And that one shall be done very soon. So they will not be able to tell their stories to anyone. And well, down here, these guys are my vassal pretty much. Oh, France declared in England. Oh wow, probably over Calais, huh? Alright, um, in uh, the new expansion, there is now a crossing over here. So you can walk from Kent to Calais, which is beautiful to be honest. Now England will actually have to participate in European wars. And they will probably get conquered at some point. Ah, oh, Netherlands exploded. Now there's Flanders in hideout. Good job, Netherlands. And we have that revolt finally. And we colonize zone. Good. You guys go fight this rebel rebel-less army. And then we'll go and fight Hekawi. For their, for their pure lands, lands of pure joy. Yes, you shall die. That is, is how I said it. And you're done. Thank you. You guys come here. Uh, we can now get the prestige from naval battles. We'll take the naval maintenance modifier soon as well. We are far away, far ahead on this anyway, so it's all good. It's all good, it's all fine. Mikawi, are you scared? Don't be. It's gonna be nice and easy, it's totally not gonna be painful. Merchants gaining influence? How is that going? How is that working for them? Well, 75 influence is not 80 very soon. Um, I could do this. 150 diplo power, I don't really need it. 
gain money from them uh, they will gain influence gains influence global settler increase but they gain influence again they lose loyalty and gains influence I can't take their influence away which is annoying to be honest would be nice if we could oh well I would gladly pay to take their influence away so right now I think you pay and you um, you get just the uh, they love you more that's pretty much it out oh, out oh, so soon so soon this shall be done but not sooner that we'll go for uh, these guys okay I'm sorry I didn't see you there but we don't want you telling your stupid story to friends here 613 leader huh pretty solid friends pretty solid and we can sit you down now sure we'll leave all the dudes here it's all good and then we'll send my ships we're gonna pick you up up here don't think there should be any revolts now. Should be fine. But yeah, I'm gonna pick this army. And just bring it home. Okay. Merchants gain loyalty. Nobility gains loyalty. I would prefer to lose Diplo, to be honest. So do that. And you guys will be able to join with the, the naval army. Because there's gonna be no more of these guys. Just come up here. You're gonna join on father. Well, not really, but we're gonna use you. Trust me. You shall be used. There we go. This is it. Last monies done beautiful and it's all us now only us now thank you you guys come here there shouldn't be any rebellions because I said so there you go just make it proper uh, that's gonna be solid Oh boy, looming disaster. Did the merchants get up to the Kadri Coop? Yep. How did they manage to get to 80 now? Huh. Well. I could, of course, take some land from them. But. I can't. So that's, that's very unfortunate. Oh well. We might have to deal with that looming disaster. And it dropped down again. Good. And Breton Paralyte happened. We need to check that out now. There it is. Breton Paralyte. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the, to the fray. Yes, work on this please. So, if I were to declare war, Brittany will join. Is not colonial war? No. Styria would not. France and the Pope would join. How is this again a thing? We are over 80 again. Weird. That's just weird game. But okay. Yeah, there's my ships. I might need to keep these guys here because, yeah, France Pants is here. Just don't don't go on ships, please. Don't go on ships, and the ships shall go here. All right, that is done. Are they gonna colonize some more, or they're happy? Here, oh, Irish. We do have certainly a very special bunch of colonizers in this game. 
Aragon declared on France. And Brittany is occupied by England. So this might be a great time to actually declare on Breton Paralite. And since they are not colonizing this, I shall do it. Alright, um, I'm gonna finish this episode here. So thank you all for watching, I do hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider dropping a comment down below. Share, like, subscribe, and I see more doing magic. And I'll see you next time. Coco out.